Hey, you in the hat. Jackson, what How you... dare you take a ladle from a pregnant woman? What? Dr. Meng very specifically said that she needs to relax and she cannot relax thinking you're in here screwing up her sauce. I'm not. Now, while there's a very good chance that you could kill me in a fight, I do not care. That woman is my wife and she is carrying my baby. So from now on, if she wants to talk, you will talk. If she wants to taste your food, you will let her taste your food. If she wants you to double strain that sauce, you will double strain that sauce, my friend, because I have to live with her. And if she is upset because of anything that you've done, I will come over here and I will soundly kick your ass. That is if you haven't killed me yet. Hey! Hey, that's it. I've had it. You've had what? She's a crazy woman, and now she's upstairs. And ladles are mysteriously flying out of the kitchen. Who's upstairs? Suki's upstairs. Oh, Suki's at home. No, Suki's supposed to be at home. And then I didn't strain the sauce twice, so she came here to drive me crazy, and she brought her loony husband with her. Jackson's here? How am I missing all this? I don't know, and I don't care. <laughs> I'm through. I'm not taking this anymore. What do you mean you're not taking it anymore? What are you going to do? You want to know what I'm going to do? Nothing because I'm in a relationship with you, and you know very well I can't leave. All I can do is come out here and say I'm through and pretend I have a leg to stand on, and then march back into that kitchen and keep doing the job. But oh boy, I'm gonna be thinking about what I would have done if we weren't in a relationship, even though that would mean I wouldn't be in this position in the first place. Excuse me. If this is the eccentric couple version of The Amazing Race, I think you guys are winning. Are we talking to her? I don't think we're talking to her. Hey, it's Lorelai. Girlfriend of Luke, and we're not talking to Luke. Well, I'm talking to Lorelai. How you doing? Suki, this is not bed rest. My feet are up. I told you not to talk to her. What is with the tude, cranky pants? He's very mad at Luke. Well, I'm not Luke. By extension, you are Luke. Suki, what were you doing at the inn? Just checking in on the restaurant. That's my job. Uh, not anymore. Your job is bed rest. Ooh. Honey, easy on the bumps. Baby doesn't like the bumps. Jackson, stop. She and that boyfriend of hers. Bossiest couple in town. Stop, at least let me ride. Oh, OK, go. <sighs> Suki, you knew the day was coming when you wouldn't be able to come in. I had three weeks. You never had any applications, did you? I meant to. No one was good enough. Well, no one's as good as you, but plenty of people are good enough. We just need one of them just to be back on your feet. I know. You know, Luke's not as good as you either. That kind of cooking's a little fancy for him, but he tried. Hey, he's not bad. It, he's pretty good in fact. It, what does he put in these? What is that? His lamb chops. They're amazing. I'm taking them home to study. Well, you could have just asked him. Mm, he's mad at me. We're mad at him. We're all going to stop being mad at each other. Now, pull over. Why? Because uh, you live here. Oh, yeah. You know, Luke said that, that Manny was, was doing pretty well. I know. I trained him. You know, when I first met him, he didn't know a gefet from a chiffonade. Yeah, well, he's from New Jersey. But he picked it up quick. Maybe he can take over while you're out, keep it in the family. He knows all your secrets. OK, we'll go with Manny. He's a good guy. I think that's a good idea. Thank Luke for me. I will. And, and find out what's in these lamb chops, because they're driving me crazy. I promise. Jackson, get her inside. And don't let her move. Hey, how are you going to get back? Oh, I thought I'd take the cart you guys stole. <gasps> Perfect. This all turned out pretty good. <sighs> Does it seem like Frodo is on every freaking channel to you, or is it just me? God, I have never been this tired. Oh, you were <sighs> one hell of a white knight today, baby. Yes, I'm a regular Lancelot. You starting to snooze? Uh-huh. Do you want to go upstairs? You're okay right here. Uh-huh. Luke. Oh. What did you put in the lamb chops? Forget it. Come on. Saved by the bell. <laughs> 